A variety of notifications are available in MyFile to inform you of events related to your filings and user account. Notifications can be configured to be sent by text message, email, or both. Notifications may also be optionally shared with individuals in your connections network. To view your notification settings, click the Settings option in the navigation pane. The Notification Settings pane is broken up into two sections, your notification settings and network notification sharing. The settings in the top section let you manage which notifications you want to receive and how you want to receive them while the bottom lets you forward various notifications to your connections. Let's look at each notification type. This notifies you after a bundle is sent to the court, but before the clerk staff interacts with it. This is sent after payment for a bundle is processed. This doesn't occur for bundles with no charge. This is sent after the clerk has accepted a filing. You get this notification after the clerk rejects a filing. A return notification is sent when the clerk needs more information from you. You can learn more about editing bundles by clicking the card on the screen or the link in the description. Choosing this will send you a notification when you receive a message in my file. This is sent for security reasons when a change is made to payment information. This is also sent for security reasons and goes out when a change is made to your account password. For your own notifications, you can choose text or email, or both, or neither by deselecting all of the boxes for that row. If you would like your connections to receive notifications by email regarding documents you have filed, you can choose those options here. Your connections will be listed, and the checkbox beside their name can be toggled on or off depending on if you want them to receive notifications. The types of notifications they receive is up to them. The checkboxes to the right will show you what they have chosen in their own notification settings, but these cannot be edited by you. It's important to know that copy notifications and copy e-service are different. Copy notifications focuses on what you specifically file and who you want to share that information with, while copy e-service focuses on what others are sending to you and which of your connections should also receive those items. These could be documents e-served by another party on a case, or the court sending documents such as orders from my file. It's also important to understand that copy e-service only works if the court is sending their notification from my file. If they are using a separate system to send notifications, such as their case management system or document management system, then your copy e-service recipients would not be notified. In those situations, you may want to set up email rules to make sure any desired recipients get notified.